Hello everybody, I am Brightman19 and welcome to episode 27 of our Prussian campaign in Europe Universe House 4. So I think it's time to pick my next target and I like Bremen. Bremen has their ally with Denmark, Lubeck and Hamburg which lets me take Lubeck or Hamburg, whichever one I feel, uh, to give me more control up here. And uh, at the same time it puts Denmark in their place so I'm fine with that. So uh, let's build Spy Network here with Bremen. Wurzburg was another possible target, but Oldenburg's there, so I probably would have gone with Trier. Alsace, Wurzburg, and Utrecht, yeah. This right here should get me a little bit more territory off in this direction. Touching Oldenburg would be kind of cool. Maybe giving Sweden some of this territory through here and letting me take some of this would be good. Bremen's trying to make claims of their own. Anhalt is now part of my territory. Gonna have a cut through here. I'd love to go to war with Poland, but I need Russia to be more willing to go to war too. If I look here. Yeah, you're at war with Japan, so that's why you won't do it. We don't really care about the uh, Imperial reforms or anything. Kohlberg, Stettin, and Westfalen have all uh, joined up. Uh, lose some money, get the loyalty of the Burgers. So let's lose the money, we can get plenty elsewhere. Westfallen can go ahead and uh, join up. Be the right faith, that is. A pretty good missionary speed. Eventual unrest, really in just Westfallen, Paderborn, Stettin, Kohlberg, Stolp, and Anhalt. Which is areas we just took, so it makes sense. How are we looking here? Waiting on this guy. Eh, I don't really care about some of that, but it's okay. Um, trade efficiency, land maintenance modifier. And we just passed that quarantining of troops. Foreign talent. Austria wouldn't like us, and we would lose a lot of money. And I don't I can't afford it, so Austria is gonna have to like me some. Uh let's go ahead and fabricate a claim I would like. I think stayed. Go ahead and let everybody get together here. If I declared war, who would help? Sweden and France. France is in some debt. Sweden. I'm going to let Sweden join up because I can give them stuff. Go here. Let's roll back right here. Nice. Detach the siege. Can we do anything if we come here? No, we can't. So we'll just wait here. Let's go ahead and take our uh, war goal. Keeping an eye back here. Freeman. Nope. Let's run over here. 
That should probably take back Stade for them. Yep, there it goes. At least there's Hanover. Let's run back. We're just waiting this out. 42% there to get Lubeck out. They got tons of troops everywhere. Oh, there goes my military leader. I need to get him back, recruit him. I got a guy who is a 3 3 2 2. There's the 50 Diplo. I could bring in France. I don't know if it's use, you know, really that useful this exact second, but we'll see. They just took on halt. It's at negative 21. Come on. Let the Ottomans. Yeah, they're all at fighting each other. Hopefully Austria can really break the uh, can be broken by the Austrians. That's what I really need. Berlin's been sieged down. You know, Sweden, I really need you to cross here. Let's go to Lundberg. This could go bad if we're not careful. Keeping an eye back here. See where Bremen doesn't really want to come at me. Let's go up here to Altmark. Come on, let me remove Lubeck. There's Sweden coming down. Okay, Lubeck. If I wanted that, a coalition will form Pomerania, Austria, Hamburg, Lubeck, Saxony, and Dithmarchen. We'll see what if which one's better on the coalition por uh, portion. Send five that away. Don't care what Death Marchin thinks about us. First off, we'll get you. Then I'll do land maintenance modifiers. We have imperialism now, so I don't really have to uh, make claims. Peace off from Lubeck. We will not do that right this second. Venice is no longer a rival. Let's come back up here.
Let's go ahead and move these guys back up here. All right, Hamburg. From you, that will be a coalition, and it looks like it will actually be worse than Lubeck. Okay, Lubeck is now mine. Want you to keep those. They are no longer allies with Sweden, so that's out of the way. Now, let's see. Denmark. That'll add a little bit more to our coalition. There's a coalition starting to Holstein. Let's take these guys up to two shell. There's Dip Martian joining this coalition. this Hinterponen. There you go. Go ahead and do that. Okay, we're looking good. Siege of An Anhalt was just one. Let's go all the way over here to Onstenbrook. Get some of that pre lovely prestige there. There goes two shell. Let's come over here. We'll go to Stade. Nope, nope, that's where the Swedes are going. Yep, that immediately changes it to my side. And I'm going to have these guys break some alliances. As for you, war reps, give me money. You're going to... Um, you and Hamburg are now done. Could have them release Brunswick. Munster. Lundberg. We'll finish up what we're doing here. I'm going to make them release a bunch of nations. I think that would probably fix some aggressive expansion problems. Well, we, on the other hand, are going to make plenty of money just sitting on top of them. To everlasting friendship, we have Friedrich II Poniatowski, the Friedrich Wilhelm heir.
I get you. I want to end it too. There's on Snubrook. Now we can end it. Pull off and back. Now we kind of need to let that coalition that's forming kind of go away. Um, let's have a chat with outraged countries. Let's focus on anyone. Not them, though. Too few rivals, um, Castile, Austria, Savoy, Aragon. I kind of like going up against Aragon. That's far away, no big deal. Yep, we have a Regency. If Henry de Valois is, is dead. Over here... There'll be a regency if Ivan Rurokovich dies. Up here. Yep, regency for us if Carl G Gilta dies. And look at the Ottomans getting beat up by Poland and Ven uh, Tuscany in them. Did not go the way I thought it was going to go. Come over here to Berlin. You guys going up to Rostock. Mecklenburg. Quite a bit for that one. Yep, quite a get those added on for seven fifty more each. Uh, next thing that's going to be up is university. So let's see where would be a good spot for one more. Right there in Riga would be nice. Königsberg being or yeah, Königsberg being the next one. Had a lot there, actually. Let's move here. Yep, you're just friends with Dith Marchin'. Kinda need to put a weight in there. Uh, take that. Feel very comfortable with it. I mean, we are not being voted on very well by the HRE. There's Oldenburg and Augsburg. By the extra, extra diplomat, I'd come out over here. Oh, there goes Oldenburg right there. That should increase our chances with him. Only be improved by three more, though. Who else? Who else in the HRE right now? I want to say France is. Yeah, France is in the HRE. Let me talk with... Fr I can make France into an elector, I think.
they are not Protestant. So, oh, they cannot be made into an elector. Can't grant you an elector because you're they are outraged. Diplomatic emperor actions. Granting an electric can only go to Brunswick and Bavaria. I don't really want to go to either one of them. Okay, this right here. 28. Um, like the trade efficiency guy, so we'll take him. I mean, I'm making plenty of power here. We're very far ahead. Yeah, we'll do that. Add some more to Fort Maintenance and Defense. We'll need one more. Konigsberg. That's a good spot for it. 1695. I'm not really where I need to be for creating Germany just yet. I mean, if you take a look, oh, there's the Kiel Canal. Need to own Dithmarchen. And administrative costs at least 26. I mean, I don't really know why that's super huge and important. Especially with Sweden, a friend. Um, I do need to own Hamburg, Hessen. Some of the stuff down here. There's a bit more to go. How do we stack up compared to, say, like Austria? Well, if to Poland we stack up 28, 3, 20, 16. Honestly, I feel like we stack up better there. Um,. How about Austria? Austria, they got more manpower, more artillery, more well, Lewis cavalry, more infantry. So we got to look out for that. They have a they have way more force limit. If we were to go attack him, we're gonna have to be really careful. Who are you friends with? Just Austria and Tuscany. Declaring a war there is going to really require Russia comes in and helps. And they're fighting in another war right now, so they're not likely to do anything. So, alright guys, I'm going to end it right here. Appreciate y'all so much for watching. Do not forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Maybe check out a link for Discord in the description below, and I'll see you all next time.